Hello Science Nuts, Sasha here and welcome to the Spanner Lab. Welcome to another day in the life of Abdullah Cahill, our scientist. It says he could start thinking about further education, he could go to university. And maybe that's something we'll consider, maybe drop me a comment if you'd like him to go to university. But he doesn't actually have to go to university. Lots of scientists don't actually go to university. There are plenty of scientific careers you can get into without a degree. And certainly in The Sims you can do it without a degree. So we might go off to university as a little side adventure, but that's not necessary. So we're just going to have breakfast. It's an important part of the day. We're getting your brain going. So let's have a just an ordinary shower to get us ready for our first day of work. So work is in two hours. Sims are incredibly slow. So he's making himself a fruit salad there. It's a nice healthy way to start the day. I don't often start the day with a fruit salad, but maybe I should. In fact, I really want a piece of fruit right now. Quite jealous of Abdullah. So there he is, he's making his fruit salad. I'm going to speed it up there because we don't need to watch this in ultra slow motion. So the you know, few minutes of contemplating the fruit salad, eating the fruit salad, still got work in two hours, uh, work in one hour. Hopefully we can have a shower before work. He's pretty uncomfortable. It's, he says that the... Oh, the fridge is cheap. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to sell that fridge because that's no good. Let's sell that cheap fridge because that's just going to make him unhappy all day. Uh, appliances, refrigerators. So this one has a food quality 2, food quality 3. So we need to get the Basically the best fridge that money can buy. How's that? It's pretty much all of his money would just get spent on a fridge. Yeah, let's do it. There you go. Oh, he's about to go to work. Uh, let's join him at work. He can... I think there might be a shower at work. Let's see. Daily experimentation. Welcome to Future Sim Labs. You'll be quite busy conducting essential experiments, researching new technology, and maybe even interacting with alien life, not a common part of any scientist's career. It is your job to leverage potent scientific equipment for the purposes of good, we hope. Well, welcome. The, the leveraging scientific equipment for good sounds very realistic. Yes, I'm just going to let him go to the toilet there while we decide what else to do with his day. So he definitely needs a wash. He hasn't managed to shower before getting to work. I think there's showers here. Or well, there should be. Not down here. Maybe there's one upstairs. Oh, there's one. So he can, he can take a shower in a minute. He's just gonna go to the toilet first. There we go, let's get taken to the shower. And then let's have a look at what our jobs of the day are. So we can ask a coworker for a crystal practice analysis and invent the momentum conserver. So that's the idea we had yesterday. Um, our social needs quite high, so we can probably invent the momentum conserver straight away. And then we can look for the machine to practice analysis on. So she's using that machine. So we want that one in a minute to practice analysis. So hopefully when it's our turn, she'll let us have it. Uh, our fun needs pretty low, so hopefully some of this makes it go back up again, because otherwise it can be difficult. Go on vacation, meet someone new, I'll put a pin in that. We'll call someone on the phone, we'll call, chat with, chat with Travis who we met yesterday. Now, you probably shouldn't be making phone calls at work, but Hey, who's going to stop him? So let's, let's get through our day. We're going to invent the momentum conserve. Or we're going to try to anyway. If our fun need keeps going down, we might have to sky off and play video games. But there we go. So I'm going to play game Sim Scuffle. I think that's Sim's version of 
Well, I've no idea what it is. We'll have a look when we have a look on the screen. Sim Scuffle sounds like some sort of fighting game, so it might be like a Mortal Kombat type thing, or it might be, you know, something like a Battle Royale, like Fortnite. We shall see. There we are, we're inventing. Let's have a look at this robot. Okay, so inventing. Inventing is is not a big part of any any scientist's day. Just talking to the robot, having it shoot things with lasers. I like the black and yellow hazard tape, you know, being nice and safe with this laser. So you can see it's got a warning on the back of it. Uh, I'm not quite sure what we're shooting lasers at. Seems to have just obliterated all those. Oh, now we've got a sphere. We've invented the momentum conserver. Turn it on and watch it spin. Drag the momentum conserver off the invention constructor and up into Abdullah's inventory to carry it around. So we can just pop that in there. Um, probably want to talk to a co-worker at some point. A friendly conversation with Don. There. Uh, fun need still going down. Oh, started an element collection. Uh, we don't need to purchase analysis anymore. Consider purchasing an elemental display rack. I think I'll do that. New element found. Found one sidralin. Wants to collect a new metal. I'm going to ask Don for a crystal. Sure, I have some extra crystals lying around. Have a crystal. Uh, he wants to gossip with his about his co-workers. Friendly gossip about co-workers. Okay, he's really tense now. We probably should uh, play video games. He'll go gossip in a minute. And then he can brainstorm on the invention constructor. And we can turn on the momentum conserver. So I can pop this on the floor somewhere. There we go, and turn it on, and then view it, I guess. How's his fun doing? Oh, he's completely filled that up. There we go. So we can go talk to Don. So I've got um, two bars full. When we get to three, that's that's given me the maximum performance for the day. Uh, he, w he wants to cloud gaze with Don. Well, should we let him go do that? Where's Don? Well, we'll see him in a minute. Where, where is he? Oh, he's on the toilet. No wonder we've got not gone to go speak to him. Uh, friendly. We cloud gaze with him. Not and yeah, now we can. We can go cloud gaze with Don. And we gossip with him. He's uncomfortable apparently. Maybe he hasn't had anything to eat. Okay, so having a, having a nice friendly conversation with Don there. Uh, and then he's going to go do some, some more science, I think. I think. There we go, so we've got gossiped. Oh, now, we, now they're going to go cloud gaze together, I think. You asked him to. And he's going to go brainstorm on the momentum conserver. I need to water a plant. Um, okay, let's go water that. Acquired some spare parts. Fantastic. I'm tense because I've not been outside for a while. I'm going to come off this. Go cloud gaze with Don. Just go cloud gaze with him. That's what you want to do, apparently. Go cloud gaze with Don. Go outside. Stop complaining with me. Go outside. Cloud gaze with Don. Oh, 
outside and, and lie next to Don outside and have a, have a nice time cloud gazing with Don. There we go. And then we give Don a hug afterwards. This is possibly not the most effective use of your workday, is giving your co-worker a hug. Um, actually, yeah, it's not. It just totally isn't. What am I doing? Go water the plants. It's making them happy, all right? The happier you are, the better work you do. Everyone knows that. Let's stop talking to Don and try and actually get some work done, done, done today. So I can extend the work day by clicking on the event timer. So I'm going to do that because I kind of spent too long trying to cloud gaze with Don and not doing any work. And then view momentum can serve us. I think I'll do that one first and then brainstorm. And then ask a co-worker for a metal so I can probably talk to someone. I've already watered the plants. I don't want to water the plants anymore. Uh, I'll speak to Kurt. Friendly conversation with Kurt. Hopefully get a metal off of Kurt. Though I should be able to finish soon. Because... Because I've nearly fill, filled up that third bar. So once I've viewed the momentum server, said hello to Kurt. He's also a lab technician, just like me. And then mix synthetic food serum. Okay, I don't think I'm going to do that today, actually. Because I have finished my work for the day. So I think I'm not working until 9... I think I've got, once I've, those two minutes are up, I'm going to just go. Uh, leave work early? Do I, am I going to get penalised for this? There we go, loads of money. And I've been promoted to Apprentice Inventor. Abdullah did a fantastic job today. It won't be long before academic prestige and scientific achievements arrive. Abdullah has been promoted to Apprentice Inventor. He'll make an additional £8 per hour for a grand total of 32 simoleons per hour. He's got new clothes, joined the stars, and his next shift is on Tuesday, so it's Monday. Good. You're going to work tomorrow. So that was an excellent day at work for Abdullah. Been promoted to Apprentice Inventor. Uh, he's got to have four breakthroughs, but first, he does really need the toilet. So let's... Give him use of the toilet. I'm going to collect a new metal and then cloud gaze with Don. I think I can do that tomorrow at work. So let's try and find him a new metal. Let's see if I can and anything's respawned. That's something. Let's dig that up. How close are we to finishing this? So that's there. Oh, someone's left a book on the floor. Was that you? Oh, Liberty Lee would like to come over. Yes, of course. Friends, obviously. Friends are always welcome. Oh, she doesn't look happy. Let's try and brighten her day. Because we're cheerful and that's really going to help in the career. What else have we got I can collect? Oh, something's happened. No. Oh, I can dig this up. Let's dig that up. Oh, and I'm hungry. So I'm going to make more salad because because my cooking skill is not very high and I will probably burn the place down. Let's try and, well, let's give up on chatting to her for a little bit. She's still sad. We'll probably sort that out. Um, I think sort that out. Leave room for our friends' feelings. But also still try and cheer them up. So I'll come back and talk to her in a minute once I've had some food. Get to know her. And then try and cheer her up. Just because it'd be nice to, to cheer someone up. A frog! I have an inventory full of frogs. Got a leaf frog, a sunflower frog, and a spotted dirt frog. Must be something you do with frogs. 
because at the minute they're just cluttering up my inventory. So I'm going to go dig up that rock. And then hopefully go back, make food, and cheer up Liberty. Uh, another fossil, so let's get that open. One fossilized sea monster, and one pre 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 sim head. Right, I've got already those, so I don't need them again. Let's get some food. Oof, she cut himself there. And then talk to Liberty, and then I think go to bed. Well, apparently it's Q's four, so I have to wait. Oh, cooking level two. She's still crying. She's still sad. Let's try and let's just chat with her. See if we can cheer her up. Uh, more fish, apparently. And she's gone. Uh, let's get her sleep then. And then do the dishes in the morning. Okay, great. So there ends another day in the life of Abdullah Cahill, our scientist. So I'm going to cut it there and I will see you again next time. Bye.